Hi, good evening. Hello. Hi, Wilfredo. Yeah. Hi. Hi, sir. Bien. Hi, Gabriel, Wilfredo, Maylin, Stephanie, Lisette, Caro, Carlita, Willy. Hi, teacher. Hi, Luis, Ivania, and Carlos Eduardo. Excellent. How is everybody tonight? Happy birthday. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, training again. Ah, it's raining. <laughs> All right, guys. Very good. Okay, so let's start. Ayer nos quedábamos en el May, en el May, May, ¿cierto? ¿Recuerdas? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Ahorita vemos. All right, so yesterday we were talking about this. Es fue el último ejercicio que hicimos, page 24, exercise 5. All right, y creo que lo logramos terminar, ¿verdad o no? Recuérdeme. Yes, teacher, I guess. Yeah, I think so. Lo que nos faltaban las cuatro que hicimos individual, ¿verdad? Sí, teacher, feliz cumple. Happy birthday, teacher. Sí, claro. <laughs> Thank you, Carol. That's nice. Thank you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Yeah, thank happy you. Happy birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Nos dejamos un pedacito de pastel, teacher. Eso. Okay. Yeah. Zoom. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. Okay. Entonces, uh, nos quedamos en esto de ayer. Creo que quedaron pendientes revisar las cuatro que teníamos que hacer extra, ¿cierto? Yes, no? ¿O lo logramos terminar? Escuchan. I don't remember. Ah, me neither. Perdón, pero si lo que pasa es que está cayendo aquí igual muy fuerte la lluvia. No sé si me escuchan. Yo sí. Ok. Sí, teacher. Solo déjeme cerrar una ventana porque no me voy a ocupar. <risa> Okay, guys, thank you, and I'm sorry. Okay, a ver, eh, Maylin, can you tell me two sentences de las que ustedes crearon en, lo, en el grupo anoche usando me and my, Maylin, ¿se recuerda? Yes, teacher. Um, my friend may, may buy a computer. Okay. My, my chains of work. Okay, very good. All right, thank you. Caro, what were your sentences? Uh, my mother might visit to me next year. And I might not to go. I might not go to work tomorrow because I'm really tired. Oh, okay, very good. I like that one, it's very good. Okay, um, what about Gabriel? Gabriel, do you have your sentences? Hello, teacher. Um, I might be late for the office tomorrow. Okay. Uh, he, he might not get up early on Sunday. Okay. All right. Very good. Let's see. Anybody else? Uh, tell me your sentences. <laughs> Le 
Rivaldo, your sentences? Sí, teacher, sí, ahorita. Okay. With, with me, go a, a gold letter. Do you think the company meet her more people next year? Okay, all right. Let's see. What about Wilfredo? <coughs> Su micrófono, Wilfred. Ah, ya. Yeah. 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 Ah, no, 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 Ok, very good. Hi, Verónica. Le extrañamos ayer, Vero. Que me sí, le... no puedo okay. conectarme. Ok, no se preocupe. A ver, solo déjeme aquí hacer algo. Give me one second, guys, please, again. Hold on, guys. I just need to get everything ready here, and I didn't have it ready. Wow. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm just checking something que está algo equivocado, pero I'm, I'm, I'm here now. Okay. All right. So, let's let's continue then today, guys. We said that um well, I said I was going to show you something an exercise related to may and might. Just give me one second. All right, vamos a trabajar en esto ahorita. Está como lenta la ítem ahorita. Wait, guys. So we're going to work on an exercise um, using may or might. All right. Y lo vamos a hacer individual. Este primer ejercicio lo vamos a hacer individual. Y el segundo ya lo vamos a hacer en pareja en nuestros grupos. Solo déjeme que cargue que se esté en a while right now. Hoy sí. Ok. Se los voy a dejar acá. Eh, ustedes lo pueden trabajar desde mi pantalla. Igual, just give me a second here. Y luego lo vamos a revisar. All right. Can you see my screen? Yes? No? Yes, teacher. All right. Very good. Yes. Ok. So, says, what's but the, but the, the letter is small. Okay. Could you... Make a little big, please. 
Is it better now? Yes, thank you. Yeah, very good. All right, so these are questions about you. And we are doing, we're using might. Ahorita solo estamos usando might, all right? Answer the questions about you. Use might in your answer. What might you do after class? Remember that might, the possibility is less, okay? Pero existe una posibilidad que usted vaya a hacer algo, okay? What time might you get out of bed next Saturday? Number three, where might you live in 10 years? Number four, what might you do next weekend? Five, when might you get a new job? Six, when might you get married? En el caso que no estén casados o casadas. What might you dream about tonight? How much money might you spend next week? Todas estas son sobre usted. Por eso lo vamos a hacer individual, ¿de acuerdo? So aquí no hay eh, respuesta correcta en el sentido que si lo va a hacer o no, sino que por estructura, all right? So, se las dejo aquí. Estoy acá igual en línea. Trabajamos en unos que... Bueno, me van diciendo, me van levantando manita cuando vaya terminando para poderles eh, revisar ahí. De acuerdo. <coughs> so, let's work on that right now. Para dar tiempo a los demás compañeros, terminamos ese ejercicio y voy a tomar la primera asistencia. ¿Ok? Teacher, una pregunta. Siempre vamos a contestar con el mayo o el may, ¿verdad? En este caso, solo con might. Solo con might, ok. Ahorita solo con might. Uh -huh.
Teacher, son solo ocho questions. Okay. Yes, Taro, only eight. You're finished? Yes. All right, very good. What about the rest of you guys? Are you done now? Voy a dar unos dos o tres minutitos más para los demás que vayan terminando. All right, let's see. Vamos a ver. Si no terminado, don't worry about it. We're gonna, uh, I guess you can work on it as you go. All right, let's see. Um, Elivaldo, what might you do after class today? Uh, I might go help ice cream. Oh, nice. <laughs> Very good. All right, Caro, what about you? What might you do after class today? I might watch a movie after class. Me too. All right, very good, nice. Okay, let's see. Veronica, what time might you get out of bed next Saturday? O sea, mañana. <laughs> Teacher, estoy un poco confundida porque como le comentaba no pude ver la clase. Sí, es cierto, Entonces, pero tienes toda la razón, no se preocupe. Las estoy tratando de hacer, pero no sé si están bien realmente. Ok, ahí lo que tiene que hacer, Vero, es poner I might y la actividad, o oh, perdón, la hora en este caso, que usted cree que podría levantarse eh, mañana, el sábado. ¿verdad? Entonces, la forma de hacerlo, Verónica, es diciendo I might... Uh, get out of bed at 7, 8, 5.30, no sé a qué horas podría levantarse el día de mañana. Right. Le había puesto como I might get up at 8 a.m. Excellent, no sé si sí, super, bien. very good, pero yes, okay. nice, thank you, excellent. Let's see, what about Wilfredo? Wilfredo number two, what time might you get out of bed next Saturday? I might uh, get out the ups and 10 a.m. Ah, nice. Very nice. Okay. <laughs> nice. Carla, where might you live in 10 years, Carla? Está difícil esa pregunta. Eso si no le he contestado, Tichi. <laughs> A ver, eh, Gabriel, number three, where might you live in 10 years? Gabriel? 
que mi teacher no ha contestado eso todavía. La tres no, vaya, ok, no se preocupe. Carlos Eduardo, where might you live in 10 years? In 10 years, I may live in Germany with my family. Oh, you might live, might live in Germany with your family. Excellent, yes. my friend. Very nice. Thank you. A ver, um, Caro, what about you, Caro? In 10 years, where might you live? Uh, similar, like, I don't know who, but I might live in Switzerland in 10 years. Oh, very nice, guys. Very good. Nice countries. Okay. Very good. Okay. Um, when might you get a new job? Vamos a ver. Hay varios con cámara apagada. No sé si no pueden participar. Si puede, me avisa, ¿verdad? Very good. A ver, Yvette, number four, sorry. What might you do next weekend? Okay. Um, I might. I might do. Um, the office. Um, what might you do next weekend? Okay, you might be in the office. I might do the office. Okay, all right, very good, that's fine. Very nice, okay. thank you. Maynard, what about five? When might you get a new job? Maynard, no? All right, all right. I le, le envío un mensaje. <laughs> ¿A dónde? Aquí en el chat. Ah, mailing, ok. Perdón, no lo había visto. Ok, that's ok. A ver. ¿Quién es más de, lo que, de los que están acá? ¿Pueden participar? Porque hay varios con cámara apagada. No sé si pueden participar o no. Evelyn, Willy, Luis, Carlos... All right, a ver. Eh, Stephanie Lisset, no sé si puede contestar la cual, la cinco. When might you get a new job? Sí, yo no le he contestado aún. Ok, no se preocupe. Voy a contestar yo esa, Picha. Claro, Carla, thank you. My is five years. Oh, you might get a, job, a new job in five years. Ok, that's fine. Very good. Let's see. Um, Caro, but you're married, right? Caro, eso no, eso no funciona para usted, Caro. Number six, when you might get married. Which one, teacher? Number six. <laughs> married. <also. laughs> but I answer it. Oh, okay. I might get married on December. Oh. It was hypothetic, no? Uh -huh. Just for the class. <laughs> yeah, okay, thank you. All right, let's see. What about, ay, 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 Carlita, vamos a ver, la siete, Carlita, what might you dream about tonight? I might when I think the right person. Oh, very nice, okay, interesting, excellent, let's see. A ver, and the last one, how much money? might you spend next week? Yvette, how much money might you spend next week? Yvette? No, okay. Oh my goodness. A ver, Gabriel, how much money might you spend next week? Gabriel, number eight, how much money might you spend next week? No, a ver, ¿quién me puede contestar esa? How much money might you spend next week? 
Okay. I have an answer. I might spend $30 next week. Okay, very good. Thank you. All right, very good. Voy a dejar de compartir aquí. A ver, um, yeah. Ok, habemos varios todavía que no podemos participar. Eh, CD, obviamente, de mailing. Karen, all right, eh, porque está indispuesta igual. Luis creo que ven tráfico. Carlos Eduardo, no sé si no le funciona la cámara y si puede participar. Sí, teacher, ha estado participando, la cámara no me funciona. Sí, excelente, sí, solo eh, confirmando, ¿verdad? Está sí. bien. Willy, can you participate? No, I guess not. Okay. And Stephanie, well, Stephanie is in trabajo. Okay. Very good. Just making sure, guys. Okay, I'm going to take the first attendance antes que se me olvide. Carlos Eduardo Artiga Berrios. Present teacher. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Marmol. Present teacher. Very good. A ver, Carolina Zúñiga Suárez. Present teacher. Thank you. Edwin Alberto Rodríguez Lobo. Eh, Stephanie Lizette Molina Rodríguez. Present. Stephanie Michelle Zuniga Hueso. Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Ivania Yamile Domínguez Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you. Present teacher, tengo un poquito de problema con. No se preocupe. Uh -huh. sí, Yvette Lizette Figueroa de Calles. Present teacher. Very good. Kenia Claribel Peñate Rivas. Uh, Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present teacher. Thank you. Mardoqueo. Yeah, Mardoqueo Ramírez Pérez. Mailing Janet Manzano Montoya. Aquí está. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Rosalina Alvarado. Rosalina is not in, right? Verónica Arelí Ayala Ramírez. Present. Thank you. Uh, William Ernesto Tobar Chacón. Yes. Xiomara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Evelyn, yes. Carlos Josué. Evelyn Beatriz Ventura Paredes, yes, right? Yes, teacher, present. Thank you, yes. Carlos Josué Chávez. Carla Lizeth García Lemos. And Luis Antonio Abreu. Present. Thank you, yes, okay. All right, okay. Ok, so this is what we're going to do now. Vamos a hacer un trabajo igual en grupo, siempre del May and Might para irlo cerrando. Ok, and then we're going to continue with our book. All right, so just give me one second here so you guys can work on this. Ok, hold on. Okay, a eso sí necesito que le tomen foto y lo manden al grupo. All right, May and Might are used to talk about the possibility of something happening. May is often more possible than might. Example, I'm not sure what to do. I may watch TV. You might not like that TV program. All right, so acuérdense que los dos se refieren a posibilidad, but eh, may is often more possible than might. Okay, entonces acá, it's not very complicated. It says complete the sentences below by using may or may not, might or might not to describe possibility. There are some dark clouds in the sky. It may rain. Aquí le están dando cuál va a usar. 
All right, so you just have to kind of like rewrite it, okay? Tomemos la foto y lo mandan al grupo, porfa. Okay, teacher. Yo lo voy a hacer más grande, Caro. Creo que ahí. Sí. Okay. Okay. I'm going to stop sharing and lo que Carola comparte en el grupo, eh, yo hago los, los grupos acá. So let's work on this right now. Ready. Thank you. Los que no pueden participar, Jai Xiomara, se quedan por acá. All right, guys, let's go. Me avisan por WhatsApp cuando ya hayan terminado, porfa. Hi, Edwin. Good morning, teacher. Good, perdón, good night. Good evening. Ahorita um, se acaban de ir sus compañeros. Lo voy a mandar a una sala porque se acaban de ir. Están trabajando con una imagen que está en el grupo. Ok, eh, gracias, teacher. All right, Edwin. Teacher. Teacher. Hola. Ay, va a disculpar, teacher, que, que pena con usted que esta semana me ha tocado pasar en la noche de trabajar. 
No se preocupe, tranquilo. Yo sé que no es lo mismo estar así, pero sí me ha costado un poco bien difícil estar así. Sí, no, no se preocupe, yo entiendo. Bueno, sí, gracias. Okay, bueno, bueno, tranquilo. Teacher, eh, no sé si, si puedo. Dígame, Mayli. Hi, Rosalina. Hi, Nina. Teacher, me salí, no sé si, si, si me puedo conectar ahí al grupo. Hi, teacher. Hi. Excuse me, I'm going late. That's okay, Nina, don't worry about it, tranquila. A ver, las voy a mandar. Eh, Meili, ¿ya puede participar o todavía no? Eh, sí, teacher, ya. Yeah. Okay. Any, any idea where you come work right now? Yeah, right now, Nina, there everybody's working on a picture that um, Caro sent. Ah, oh, okay. Mighty El May. Ahorita la mando, permítame. A ver. Vaya, Nina. Eh, Maylin la mando ahorita, oye. Okay. okay. Stephanie, usted ahorita no puede, ¿verdad? ¿O cómo no? Sí, sí. ¿Segura? Si no, no hay problema. Está bien. Estoy tratando de contestarlas, pero tengo una duda. Ajá. Este, vamos a, a poner como el porqué de la, de la situación, por decir algo. Vamos a ver, permítame, ahorita la ven. A ver. Um, ajá, o sea, ahí les están dando como una situación y usted tiene que usar el might, ¿verdad? Es, por ejemplo, la número dos dice, it's 9.30 and Jack feels tired. Son las nueve y media y Jack se siente cansado. Entonces, él podría irse a dormir ahorita. Ah, okay.
All right, we're just gonna wait for everybody else to come back and then we can check the exercise and take the other attendance. Teacher, Miss Ali. <laughs> that's okay, Mary, that's fine. That's fine, that's okay. All right, I think everybody's back now with us. So let's see, we have for number one, um, wait. Well, number one, just about it for nosotros. Number two, it's 9.30 and Jack feels tired. All right, después de, de oír eso, what can we say using might? Anybody that gives me examples. For number two, what are the possible answers? A ver, Elivaldo. Okay, it might work a lot. Okay, all right. Anybody else with another possible answer? Go ahead, Caro, yeah, please. He might fall asleep. He might fall asleep, yes. That's a big possibility. Uh -huh. Another choice. Anybody else? Nina? It's the same with uh, what we hear. We hear. Oh, with Caro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, we're a team. I know, you guys are a team. Well, you were working with Carlita also, right? Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, a ver, Ivania's group, ¿qué pusieron en la número uno? Um, la número uno. La, la misma que dijo. La misma el que dijo Carlos Erivaldo. Ok. All right, ok. Ok, let's see, what about number three? The situation is my, my class starts soon. But I'm not sure where the classroom is, okay? De las que hicieron esa, may not. What can be the possible answer or the possible situation? The number three? Yes. We, Carlita, vas a... Yes. Okay. La voy a representar ya que me dijeron. <laughs> Excellent, Carlita. <laughs> I, may, I may not get up time to my class. Oh, yes, you may not be on time or you may not get on time to your class. Okay, very mm -hmm. good. Excellent. A ver, Evelyn, Evelyn's group, what do you have for number three? What is the possibility? It may not arrive on time. Uh -huh. Very nice. Okay, alguien diferente de... De los grupos de ya sea de Evelyn o de Caro? Nosotros. Ok. Uh, I may not uh, where is the classroom because a new student. Oh, I may not know where the classroom is because I'm a new student. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Next situation. Sara has some money and she is at a clothing store. Uh-huh might what might happen veronica what do you have for that one for number four um she might buy pants uh-huh <laughs> she might buy pants tiene el dinero es ahí why not right <laughs> okay very good um gabriel do you have another one or está trabajando con vero Sí, en la sala cuatro con, con Verónica. Ok, very good. ¿Alguien más um, from a different sala? Nosotros. Yes, ok. Ok. She may spend all her money. Ay, no, Dios no lo quiera. She might spend all her money. <laughs> ok, very good. Ok, um, let's see. From an Edwin, from another group, the answer is... <coughs> Or anybody else, Wilfredo, or I don't know, Yvette, or anybody with number four. Okay, teacher. Um, permiso, voy a buscar la imagen para leer la pregunta. Okay. 
me perdió. Ok. Um, number four. Sara has some money. Um, she is at a clothing store. Mm, my. Yeah. Uh, eh, la respuesta eh, que nosotros pusimos es she might buy something in the store. Yeah, she might she might buy something in the store. Very good, Yvette. Thank you. Yes. Yes, very nice. Hi, Chavez. Perdón, no lo había saludado. Hello, hello. All right, very good. A ver, Carlos Eduardo, what about the next situation? Situation five, I think it is. Kelly and Jenny are friends, but they live in different cities. They are both traveling to Washington this summer, May. Okay, este... They may meet in Washington. They may meet in Washington. Yes, very nice. Thank you. All right, I'll give us from a different group. Sí. They may visit museum ah. together. Oh, very nice. They may they may visit the museum. Very nice. I'll give up from another group. Thank you. Nosotros. Okay, uh, excellent. They may fly in plane to Washington and enjoy it together. Oh, very nice. I like that one. Very nice. Okay, thank you. Chavez, ya lo veo. Hi, Chavez. All right, very good. Hi, teacher. Hi. All right, number six. It's cold outside, but James isn't wearing a jacket might what might happen to him guys anybody Xiomara escuchemos a Xiomara number seven yes we may order the food now ah no creo que era la número seis yeah it's number six I'm sorry In number six I might lend one of my jacket to James. Oh, that's very nice of you. Thank you. All right, excellent. Another answer for number six. Yeah, nosotros, he may get six. Yes, <laughs> for sure. Yeah, that's a big possibility. Another one? We have the same answer that Gabriel. Oh, no. He might get sick, yes. Yeah, that's the most probably. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. <laughs> no kidding. Okay. Very good. Let's do now number seven. Okay. A ver, Wilfredo, number seven says, my brother is at a restaurant and he feels a little hungry. May. He may order food. <laughs> Very good. Maybe he may order food. Yes. Okay. Anybody else? Or Wilfredo, no sé si tiene diferente. That's a different answer. If you have a different answer. Okay. All right. Anybody else? Maybe Gabriel, or Alivalto, Veronica. No. Uh -huh. You may order the menu. Yeah, oh. he may order from the menu. Tiene lo mismo, carito. Yes, teacher. Teacher. Awesome. Gabriel, you are reading my mind. <laughs> Se copiaron, teacher. Con el estero. Yo creo. Hicimos que... chancuco. Yeah, that's the same, <laughs> the same, the same answer. Uh, he may ask about menu. Yeah, he may ask about the menu. Yes, yes, Carlos Eduardo, tell me. My brother asked me what we can eat. Okay, yes, your brother may ask what you can eat. Very nice, thank you. All right, let's do the last one. I should go to work today, but I feel a little sick. Might not. Anybody? Dígala primero, Gabriel, para que no le digan que copió. <laughs> uh, uh, he may not go to work. Ay, era, ¿verdad? I might. Ajá, I might. He might not go to work. Yes, I might not go to work. Okay, a ver, Nina, también tiene lo mismo, Nina. Yes, 
teacher. Yes, the same, the same. Pero le faltó today. Logical today. answer for us. <laughs> Okay, that's okay, very good. That's a coincidence. It is yes. a coincidence, yes. <laughs> All right, let's see. Xiomara, do you have any different answer? Or Carlos Eduardo? Yes. Number eight, verdad? Yes, the last one, Xiomara. Okay. I may not visit the doctor because I have a lot of work. Oh, okay. Okay, that, that happens. Okay, very good. Okay. Thank you guys. Okay, so I'm going to take the second attendance. So please listen to your name as I call it out. Carlos Eduardo Artiga Berrios. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Marmol. Present teacher. Carlos Mauricio Gamero Aguilar. Carolina Zuniga Suarez. I'm here, teacher. Edwin Alberto Rodriguez Lobo. Stephanie Lisette Molina Rodriguez. Present. Stephanie Miguel Zuniga Hueso. Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Present teacher. Ivania Yvonne Domínguez Hernández. Present teacher. Yvette Lisette Figueroa de Calles. Present teacher. Karen Beatriz Morataya Segovia. Kenia Claribel Peñate Rivas. Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present teacher. Very nice. Mardoqueo Ramirez Perez. Mailing Janet Manzano uh, Montoya. Present teacher. Thank you, Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Oscar is not in. Oh, no, verdad? Rosalina, Oscar. Oscar is there. Wait, guys. Yeah. Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. Yeah. Veronica Arelia Ayala Ramirez. Present. Miguel Ernesto Tobar Chacón. Xiomara Elizabeth. Present, present teacher. Thank you. That's fine. Present. Thank you. Evelyn Beatriz Ventura Paredes. Present. Carlos Josué Chavez. Present teacher. Carla Lizer García Lemos. Present teacher. And Luis Antonio Abrego Salavia. Right, Present good. teacher. Yes, thank you. A ver, Kenia Claribel is she? Kenia, Kenia. All right. Teacher, Kenia no tiene energía en la casa. Oh, okay. Y Karen Beatriz está con nosotros. Karen, sí. I'm here, teacher. Yes, I know, Karencita. No, tranquila. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Caro, gracias por informarme. Very nice. Thank you. All right. So let's continue then, guys, here with this, with your book. All right. So we're done with this. Okay, let's go on here right now. Unit two, page 25, exercise. Well, I will be able to, and then exercise one and two. I will be able to request and give refunds due to bad service. Number one, what options would you give your customers if a product you offer is not on good condition? Nina, imagine that you sell a product, okay? or a service, and okay. your customer is not satisfied, all right, and they ask for a refund. Is there any option? Like, do you, do you think, can you think of any other options about this issue, how to deal with this, um, Nina? Mm, I think maybe change the products. Change the product? Yeah. Okay, you can change the product, okay. Anybody else? What and what else can we? I mean, Nina said change, we can change the product. Return the money. Re refund Maybe. the money. Yes, completely. Yeah. All right, very good. Anybody else? Now, 
Okay, let's, let's pretend that we only have those two choices. We can change the product or we can give the money back, okay? Now, if you were the unsatisfied customer, Nina, what would you prefer? To get another product, like to change the product or would you prefer the money back? Mm, in, in, in right... Right now, I think when I have experience in Pizza Hut, <laughs> yeah, I put the order yes. and maybe the waiters forget it. Uh -huh. My family, uh -huh. after one hour, come to <laughs> the table and ask about the order. And I say, what happened? Uh, if uh, one hour ago, I put the order and the manager come and, and, and told me, uh, the order is free for you, plus uh, give some uh, dessert and something, Excellent. and then I feel happy <laughs> and maybe forget the problem. But yes, okay. for that, I, I think um, sometimes it's better if you change the product for, for another one and give also. And when you re, uh, come back the money, maybe it's como. Se acaba el trato y no vuelvo ahí, ¿eh? o sea, yeah, okay. O sea. So it's a close deal. <laughs> yeah, All right. yeah. Okay, very good. Okay. okay, thank you. Chavez, if you buy a product or a service and for some reason you're not satisfied, would you rather your money back or would you rather a change of a product or like the same product but a different one? Okay, teacher, my, my own experience about that uh, was uh, the same. Uh, Nina, okay. uh, uh, when, I, when I was be in the, at, at, at Pizza Hut, <laughs> in Pizza Hut, uh, I bought pizza uh, of, of pepperoni with with onion and a lot of cheese. Uh, the, ¿Cómo puede decir de la vendedora si se equivocó? Yeah, the, the waiter or the waitress made a mistake. Make a mistake and, 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 and finally uh, I was talking with the, with the supervisor. Okay. And, and, the, and then uh, give me a, a gift. Uh, I give another pizza or a, a dessert, a like like Nina. Oh my goodness! Let's go to Pizza Hut, guys, and then esperando. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Very good. Thank you, Chavez. All right. What about? <laughs> yes. Thank you, Gabriel. What about you? If you buy something and you are not happy, do you want your money back? Or do you want like them to change your product? Gabriel, es su micrófono. No he tenido ningún problema. Bueno, hasta hoy compré okay. algo así, como le decía, a use return, a word that above bros. O que trae algo así como hormiguitas, por eso lo acabo de ir a devolver. Oh, ok. ¿Y pidió otro o le dieron el dinero de regreso? Me re devolvieron el dinero. Ok. All right, very good. Carla. A ver, Carlita, what about you? If you buy a product and you're not happy, do you want your money back or another product? No, no he tenido ningún problema cuando pido. Nada, ni cuando compra nada, mm. eh. tal vez no solo comida. Es rara vez que yo compre comida así. Ajá, pero no solo comida, sino que una blusa, un jean, zapatos, y de repente se le arruinaron en una apuesta. <risa> I don't know. No. Never. No. Ok. Never. Y pensemos que si le pasara a Carlita, a ver, compró unos par de zapatos, all right, y se le arruinaron a la primera. What would you do? Regresaría al lugar y pide un cambio de zapato o you want your money back? 
money book. <laughs> okay. All right. Very good. A ver, <laughs> Carlos Eduardo, y creo que Carlos tenía, quería decir algo. A ver, Carlos Eduardo. Okay, teacher, my experience uh, in the AliExpress. Uh -huh. I may not purchase vehicle parts on I because this the size uh, key via problems uh, in the warranty, in the pounds, yeah, and many more. Okay. So what happened at the end, Carlos? Did you get the money back or did you get another product? Money back. Okay. All right. Very good. Excellent. Caro? Uh, depends, teacher, because in some cases, I would prefer the return to the money, but for example, it is something that I need, for, for example, for the study, for my daughter, and I need the product, so yeah, you, you, you ask for I, I, I have to accept the exchange of the product. Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. All right. But in other cases, it's okay if you get your money back, right? All right. Very good. Thank you. Evelyn, what about you, Evelyn? If they make up, like, if you're not happy with the product, do you want the money back or do you want another product? It depends. If I need the product, I ask for the chains. Or, or, or return the, the money and visit other. Another store. Other store. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Now, no, let's not think about food because I know Pizza Hut, I guess Pollo Campero, they do kind of like the follow, they do the same, all right? But let's think about a product, uh, maybe a blouse, shoes, um, I don't know, glasses, cell phones, all right? In El Salvador, think about El Salvador, all right? What is more common for the store, no por el cliente, for the store to do? Do they, the stores give you the money back or they exchange products? What happens in El Salvador, guys? Change product. They change product? Always. Huh? Always. They don't give you the money back? Yeah. yeah, very, very weird. Very, like, rarely they give you the money back, all right? Tara, what about in Colombia? Is it the same? Is it usual that the store gives you the money back? Or is it more usual that they give you a, another product? Uh, in general, they prefer change the product, but depend of the political, there, there, there are uh, some stores that uh, return the money. Okay, all right. But it's a few, few, few stores that okay. do that. How so do you that. say? Okay. How do you say? Llegan con pistola en mano. <laughs> yeah, they're very aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, all right, interesting, very good. Okay, so let's go back here then. It says, read the following refund form. Ese es un formulario donde le regresan el dinero. All right, now it says, note. Please note, Waterlux customer satisfaction warranty is 90 days from date of purchase. All right, number two, retain a copy of your records and close the original with the merchandise. Number three, use one line per item. All quantities are to be reported in each space. All items returned will require the original order number recorded on the form so credit can be processed, okay? Entonces, sí le pueden dar su dinero, pero tiene que cumplir con estas tres cosas. Una, the satisfaction warranty is 90 days. Si usted se pasó 91 días, pues ya no, ¿no? All right, you're, you're satisfied. All right, so tiene que pasar entre los primeros 90 días o for three months de la fecha de la compra. Uh, number two, retain. Es como tenga, ¿verdad? Tenga una copia de su récord, de sus eh, recibos en este caso. And close 
Eh, ¿Qué sería en close en español, guys? Enclose the original with the merchandise. Incluir. Sí, incluir, adjuntar, ¿verdad? El, el, el recibo original junto con la mercadería, merchandise. And number three, use one line per item. Si usted va a regresar varios eh, ítems, all right, entonces tiene que usar en este, en este caso una línea por ítem que va a regresar. All right, so everything needs to be like that. Now here, it's recent code. Uh, it's in this AED and PP, so dissatisfaction, why? The product performance, so quiere decir que no funcionaba. The item, the item number is B7869, the quantity, how many? The date of purchase, era esta. The order number and re relevant recent missing parts. No iban completo lo que estaban, eh, lo que compraron, all right? So here it says, check the refund form to answer the questions. Compare answers. What are the reasons the customer wants a refund? Would the customer get the refund and why? Estas dos preguntas las vamos a hacer ahí. All right, en los grupos y déjeme ver aquí. Necesito. Give me one second, guys. I just want to check something. Hicimos el listening de estos la vez pasada, de la página 23. Can you check? O oh, esas no. Claro, mandó unas la vez pasada que me ayudó a mandarle ese link. Fueron estas o fueron yes, otras. Teacher. Those mm. were the ones. No me acuerdo. Let me check. Sí, teacher, las tres preguntas sí las, sí, las hicimos. Las tres preguntas sí, pero el listening, esos listening que están ahí se hicieron. Do you remember? No. Creo que no. El que no, 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 fue esas no fueron. Que... O sea, lo, lo, lo mandé para. Sí, pero fue, ya le, ya le encontré, Caro. Fue donde decía, listen to a conversation about a person ordering food. Esa fue. All right, de la página anterior. Entonces, quiero que oigamos estas. Igual, Caro, si me ayuda, eh, ponemos esta en el chat. Listen to people showing dissatisfaction about different situations. All right. Okay. Estoy en la show. I want you to include these two links. Caro, please. Entonces, vamos a oír. Oigan eso nada más por practice. Ok, ya los mando. Thank you. Y terminamos este ejercicio de acá, el ejercicio 3, basado en, el, en estas eh, reclamos, digamos. Y de igual forma, quiero que escuchen estas conversaciones. Entonces, Caro, son cuatro links de la página 23 y la página 25, Caro. Ok. <coughs> Todo eso lo vamos a hacer en grupo, so you guys can practice your listening and then answer the questions, okay? So let's go. Chávez, lo voy a unir a un grupo. Okay, okay Stephanie, me avisa si ya puede participar. Ya, yeah, teacher. Excelente, very good. And Edwin, igual. Perdón, teacher, ¿cuáles páginas me dijo que eran las del...? 23 y 25, Caro. Ok. 25, 
Listo, teacher. Thank you, Caro. ¿Tiene todavía activa ahí la sala? Hola Edwin.
sorry guys. All right, very good. So, um, let's work on this. No, no funcionaban todo, ¿verdad? No, teacher, daba an error. Okay. All right, that's okay. <coughs> Veamos aquí entonces. Let's share this here. Okay. All right, number one, what are the reasons the customer wants a refund? What do you think the reasons are? Um, maybe, maybe when they when the products expire. Okay. All right. Very good. Another reason. Any other any on the, any other reason why the customer wants a refund? I have another one. Okay. May I? Yes, of course. Uh, the, when the product is broke. Broken? If, yeah. If I buy uh, something and when I open the box, the product inside is broke. Okay. All right. Very good. Yeah, probably. And in, in this case, also says missing parts, right? There were not, if the parts were not complete. All right. Very good. Number two, would the customer get the refund? What do you guys think? Do you think the customer would get the refund? Yes, because it meets the requirements. Yeah, it meets the requirements. Very good. Yeah, I like that. Very nice. Thank you. Okay. All right. So here we have this. How to use would and would like to. Okay. Y volvemos. Estos son siempre uh, modal verbs. Por lo tanto, no cambia para nadie. Y su negativo, ¿cuál sería? ¿Cómo hacemos eso en negative? Wouldn't. Yeah, wouldn't or would not, ¿verdad? Solo le vamos a poner el not. No el don't, no el didn't, no ningún otro auxiliar. Los model verbs no necesitan auxiliar. All right, solo necesitan the negative, que sería not. All right, a ver. Uh, ni, uh, Luis, a ver Luis, léame la columna donde dice would and mainly la, la columna donde dice would like to. Okay, teacher. Uh, I will change this product. Mm -hmm. He will buy there again. We will not stay in this place. Would you give me your information? Okay, thank you. All right. Mary, can you continue with would like to? Yes, teacher. Uh, would like to. I would like to change this product. He would like to buy there again. Uh -huh. They will. What? How do you say? Yeah, that? you wouldn't. They yeah. wouldn't like to. Well, sorry, teacher. I don't listen. Yes. Um. They wouldn't like to. They. They wouldn't. Wouldn't like. To come back here. Okay. You like to get a refund? All right, a oh. refund. Yes, a refund. Very good. Very nice. So here we have would and would like to. Okay. Um, acuérdense que el would like to siempre va a ir junto. I would like to change. I would like to go. I would like to buy. I would. I wouldn't like to come. Uh, would you like to get, all right, siempre va junto, el would like to es como una, ya no es un uh, verbo modal nada más, sino que es una frase modal, all right, porque ya va would like to, ok. Mientras que el would solo va la palabra, en ese caso sí es a modal verb, el otro es a, a phrase, a like a, a phrase, a modal phrase, ok. Now, independientemente, usamos el would o would like to, y sigue, o lo que le sigue es el verbo en infinitivo sin ninguna conjugación. I would change this product. He would buy there again. He wouldn't say in this place, would you give me your information? The other one, I would like to change this product. Again, cuando usted dice, llega a un almacén y usted le dice a la señorita o al caballero que la atiende, Uh, excuse me, I would like to change this product. It's very, very polite. Me gustaría cambiar este producto. 
ok, no solo llega y le dice I want to change this product, aunque a veces es necesario llegar así alright, so, so they listen to you ok, si se llega así como muy soft, es así como, no, sorry I'm not going to help you, alright so, that is the difference between would and would like to uno es más polite que el otro al final, would like to es aún más nice, ok, now here it says complete the following statements or a question, I would like to Mr. Trujillo wouldn't, would she, would like to, she wouldn't, hay un error de, de dedo ahí, wouldn't, uh, igual que el otro, en lugar de world, debería decir would, would you like to, ok, para hacer estas seis, ya estas seis que tenemos aquí, Quiero que nos vayamos a los grupos y la terminen. Háganla juntos y juntas. All right? Este ejercicio de acá. Luego, esto lo vamos a hacer individual, el ejercicio 6. So let's go right now. Exercise 5, a terminar lo que ya empezaron acá. Acuérdense que en las 5 y en las 6 hay error de dedo. Es would. Ok, no world. Complételas. With whatever information you want. Cuando regresemos, compartimos.
creo que me salí de nuevo. <laughs> Alright guys, we're almost finishing here. Veamos los que logramos hacer on this page. Um, we'll complete the following statements or questions. Number one, Evelyn, what do you have for number one? I would like to. I would like to visit to Paris. I would like to visit Paris. All right, I would like to visit Paris. I would like to visit Paris. All right, very okay. nice. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Chavez, what do you have for number two? Mr. Trujillo. <clears throat> este, la, Mr. Trujillo wouldn't travel with her. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Very nice. Okay. Very good. Let's see. Next sentence, number three. Carlita. Okay. Would she buy a new bag? Would she buy a new bag? Yes. Oh, all right. Corrigen. Yeah. No, no, está bien. Would she buy a new bag? <coughs> yes. Thank you. Xiomara, what do you have okay. for number four? Number four. I would like to eat healthy. We'd like to eat healthy. Yes. Ah, oh, all right. Yeah, I would like to. <laughs> Very good. Thank you. Yvette, can you do number five? Oh, five. Um, she won't, won't, won't not. Would not or wouldn't? Uh huh. Uh huh. Would not use this dress. Oh, all right. Very nice. Thank you. Wilfredo, okay. what do you have for number six? Would you like to walk in the park? Ah, oh, would you like to walk in the park? <coughs> That's nice. All right, very good. Anybody else? Cualquiera eh, que quieran hacer rapidito alguna? Okay, teacher. Uh, number six. Uh -huh. uh, uh, would you like to have a kitchen? Yes, I would. <laughs> <laughs> very good. I like that one. Very good. Carito, vi que me levantó la mano. Yes, the number four, we would like to drink some beers or micheladas. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's, it's Friday. Friday. <laughs> it's Friday. Okay, very nice. Luisito, a ver Luis. Oh, okay, teacher number one, I would like to enjoy life. Yeah, of course, we would all like to enjoy life. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Okay, guys, so we're finishing right now. Necesito que avancen con su unidad 2. Acuérdense que después de la unidad 2 también tenemos el examen de medio curso. Ya, qué rápido. All right, la unidad 2 igual la terminamos el lunes. All right, vamos a ter terminar la unidad 2 lunes. Y luego ya obviamente empezamos con la unidad 3 y es sobre el pasado. Así es que eh, pues les invito a que estén aquí un poquito más presentes. A ver, Carito, dígame. Teacher, I have a, a question. Uh, estaba haciendo los ejercicios sí. y justo el tema que estábamos viendo hoy, intenté completarlo justo como están los ejemplos, pero no me agarra. Entonces, no sé si... Porque lo copié justo como está en el texto. O sea, ya lo había escrito en diferentes con el punto, con la... Mayúscula y todo. Primera en mayúscula. mayúscula. Y me lo sigue fallando. No sé qué estoy haciendo mal. Pero hágame en el de would, you'd like. Si me lo and manda. Would. Si, me, si me manda la tarea que corresponde el número exacto y mándemelo como usted lo está poniendo. Y déjeme, oh. déjeme ver porque eh, para poderle ayudar. De acuerdo. Ok, Pero teacher. Se lo voy a mandar. Ayudar. Gracias. Ayudamos a teacher. todos los demás que están en la misma tarea. Dígame, Luis. Teacher, yo... Eh, eh, Ya igual ya lo completé, pero estoy en el examen, en la última parte del examen, de las cuatro partes, y exactamente es una oración que ya la puse de, de todas formas. formas con el texto, y no me, no, 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 no me la acepta, siempre me la toma mala. Bueno, Luis, igual uh -huh. hagamos lo mismo, Luis, mándeme una captura, así como lo está poniendo usted, eh, uh -huh. detalleme exactamente qué sección es, yo sé que es del examen, mándemelo y lo vemos ahí para poderles ayudar a todos igual, ¿ok? Ok, teacher. Excelente. Okay. Tomo la última asistencia y los dejo descansar. Carlos Eduardo Artiga Berríos. Gracias, teacher. Carlos Elivaldo Abrego Mármol. 
Carlos Mauricio. Present teacher. Aguilar, thank you. Carolina Zúñiga Suárez. Present teacher. Edwin Alberto Rodríguez Lobo. Stephanie Lisset Molina Rodríguez. Present. Stephanie Michelle Zúñiga Hueso. Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Present teacher. Ivane Yamilet Domínguez Hernández. Present teacher. Yvette Lisset Figueroa de Calles. Present. Thank you, Karen Beatriz Morataya Segovia, Kenia Claribel Peñate Rivas, Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present, chair, good night. You. Yes, good night to you too, Mardoqueo Ramirez Perez, Maylin Janet Manzano Montoya. Present, Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza, Rosalina Alvarado. Present, teacher. Verónica Arelia Ayala Ramirez. Present. Thank you, William Ernesto Tobar Chacón. Present. Mara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. Evelyn, thank you, Evelyn Beatriz Ventura Paredes. Present teacher. Carlos Josué Chávez. Present teacher, good night. Yes, thank you, good night. Carla Elizabeth García Lemos. Present teacher. And Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present teacher. Great right, guys, thank you so much. Mándenme las capturas y vemos eso, de acuerdo. All right, guys. Thank you. Happy weekend. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.